All right, dudes and dudettes, welcome back to All the Mods 8. Guys, last episode, we set up the refined storage system, which is very cool. But today, we got to get into making some iron because I'm sick and tired of mining for iron. And is that gone? No, it's good. It's good. It's, it's still there. But yeah, um, we have mined enough and we're done we're done mining so we're going to put all of this in here and then we're going to look up some uh, interesting ways to get some iron and see if we can get some automated there we do have a couple methods in modded minecraft here uh, and we'll check those out okay so the couple of different options that we have uh, we can easily do iron essence from iron seeds from mystical agriculture which is a very good reliable option with one that i do believe we might end up doing regardless uh, we could use the crushing wheel um, and we can crush, let's see here, we can crush tough in the crushing wheel. And we have a 10% chance of getting an iron nugget. Jeez Louise, that scared me. Uh, we have a 10% chance of getting an iron nugget. Let me do that again, jeez. And we get zinc, copper, and gold. This one might be good to set up. However, to make tough, we need stone essence and fire essence. So. Mystical agriculture is pretty good, and the the other alternative would be to use iron combs from productive bees with an iron bee. Um, these guys can be bred with an ashy mining bee and a crystalline bee, which we get in the nether, and this one we just find around. Um, we can make nests and call it good. I do believe there was a an issue earlier, real quick, about making wooden swords. Hmm. Okay. Um. Uh, Bodzio man left us this present. We got some compressed uh, iron ingots, some pressure tube, and then uh, lengthy netherite pickaxe of coring with fortune five on it. He said he was able to find a really cool way to get uh, fortune on it, which was really awesome. So we will definitely be utilizing that. Uh, I loved having more compressed iron ingots, but yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and get into mystical agriculture here. And this is gonna be our spiel for today. So we're gonna need an infusing altar and infusion petals. Um, so we just need some red wool. Um, what are they called? Poppies now, right? Nope. We gotta go find some. All right, we got some red flowers here, which is really good. Just use these to mine up some things. Lots of creepers, it's a blood moon. Always the best moon. Okay, so we have we have a couple of these that have been acquired here, uh, and we wanna make some wool. Should be able to make enough. Okay. So here we go, we got one of these guys, and is it, oh, it's one to one, okay. So we need, how many was it? A total of eight, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we need a total of eight. So we need three more poppies. All right, and we place the last one here, and then all we need to do is just give this kind of a redstone signal, and now we can uh, build all the, the seeds we want. I accidentally clicked this with the red dye, by the way. We'll change it back eventually. Um, but yeah, let's take a look here. Uh, we need to get some mystical agriculture seeds. There we go, mystical. We need the prosperity seeds. Ooh, nice, a full stack of those. Very cool. Okay, so... Um, yeah, we need to get good materials. And to do so, here's the essence. Um, we have 936 essence. So we need to use maybe two of these guys here and then we convert it into the higher tiers. So we need to go all the way up to tier three. Okay, so we're gonna do, we're gonna do this. That's a thousand uses each. Wow, that's a lot. Okay. And then we'll go up to the next tier, which is here. Put these back. We got 58 of them. Okay, we're gonna grab some iron as well. Booyah, and we have the seeds. Great, so this means we can make a couple of these seeds. So I'm gonna go ahead and probably make eight of them. We don't have to put these in any specific way, but I have to do it this way. Oh wait, we need to put the seeds in the middle. There we go. Here we go, and iron seeds, amazing. So now we can make some more of them. So 
this gives us good seeds and while that's going what we can do is set up some garden cloches these guys here res p okay and then we need this guy which is two iron plates perfect and then we need some copper perfect cool so that's 28 of them we can make a bunch of these guys so we should be able to craft up a fairly good amount of these 11 what are we missing glass oof Cool. Okay, so now we have 19 garden cloches. That's way more than we need. I'm only going to make eight of these, but I will be back. I'll make eight more of these guys, and we will be good to go. So, boom. Here we go. All right, so we have eight iron seeds crafted up here, and I've just been kind of looking around, trying to see if maybe it'd be a good idea to put the cloches over here. You know, it might not be the worst idea ever. Uh, we can just expand this out. Oops, I mined the glass. Didn't mean to do that. But, wait, why don't we have block sounds? Weird. Some sound glitches is what it's called. <laughs> Anywho, it doesn't mean uh, a whole lot. Uh, just that we have no sound. That's okay. So all of that's taken care of here. Um, the garden cloches we will put kind of back into this wall a little bit. Perfect. And then, yes. So we need to make this go back by at least one more block. And then we can go... Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, those look good too. We'll run power up above them. Actually, we can just break these. I don't know why I placed them down. We need to kind of make sure everything is in line first. Perfect. Okay, and then I figured we'll probably just do one of these guys. There we go. Okay. So we take the cable and we put it right here. Oh, wait. Nope. Nope. We messed up a little bit. Okay. Oh yeah, so that fills up. We will probably go ahead and connect these guys in here too. Um, yeah, kind of like this. Um, okay, and this might get a little ugly. Cool, now all of the power is connected to one another. Just how we didn't want it. <laughs> that looks kind of crappy, but we'll send it. Okay. That looks reasonably better if you squint. Okay, and so then these guys go here. And they all have power now. And then we run these here for the back for those. And then we run, let's see, I need my pipe wrench. This here, we take it out. We'll just do that. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. And boom, okay. We also have a crafter from RF Tool, so we can give it the recipe um to craft and it will do so it will do such things um i just run a cable back here like that 
Yeah, and we'll put the output on that side because now we can put a block here so it won't look as bad. How do we get blocks out of there? Hey, do not know. Um, well, the blocks have to go into there actually. So this actually isn't gonna work. We need to put this guy here. So then that gets the items and gets good, cool, okay. So that's working good. Uh, we need to make a sink real quick. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. This will fill it with water. Do I have everything? I just need a bucket of water. I think I have a sink in here. Yes, I do. We're gonna, we're gonna actually take that guy out and put it somewhere useful. We'll put it like right here. And so now we can make one specifically for our system up there. Very good, okay. And so we will basically, actually we can just put it in the ground really like right here and then do this. So now each of these has water. Yes, cool. And yes, yeah, so all we gotta do now is, oh, we need to make the, uh, the dirt, proper dirt for it. So we're gonna do use the tertrium Tertium, yeah, and we'll make dirt with it. So if we go uses, we should see there is the ability to make farmland. Uh, we need a hoe. Why are tools so weird in this? What happened to the normal tools? Okay, let's put that there, that there, bam. Okay, we didn't need that much, but it is okay. All right, so here here and if we do this it should be good yeah all right there we go so our iron seeds are a growing and so this guy will run continuously uh, which will be amazing and then we'll pump it into a drawer right here so let's go get a normal drawer that all of our iron will be in um, or wait a second I have an idea we could uh, just do we could we could just put a simple chest there but yeah oak chest we could pump it into our system um, okay you don't need to have this much you're just sugar cane Okay, so we need to make a couple of things here. One, we need to make a storage controller, uh, which requires two blocks of quartz and then a redstone comparator. Boom, so this will register all of our storage items next to each other. So our system will be able to see it. I don't know if it has to be in line. I don't think it does, but we're gonna do it anyway because we can so that goes here it really like it sees all of these drawers and can do fun things so let's see we have 16,000 iron that can be stored here so what we're going to do is we're going to make an external storage drive um or reader basically and we are going to need some more of these guys okay so we have seven processor binding is gone okay so click that here. Actually, we don't need that anymore. We do need this. Beautiful. And then now we just need some cable. Ooh. Ooh, we are running low. Let's get some sand in there. Okay, so we have the two additional sands. We can have a couple more of those. So let's make the external storage. So this will now our system will be able to see all of the items we have in storage, which is amazing. Um, yeah, so we need to have this block here. Um, I actually think that we can just have it connect off of this. Priority, set it to 100. And da, 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 da. do we see a bunch of sugar cane? Oh, no. We're not going to because this needs to be here. Priority, set this guy to 100, and then we place this. Oh, wait, you need to link it. I forgot. Okay, we need this linking card. Um, yes, linking tool. Oh, that was our last diamond. 
cool. So now there's, there it is. That's all of that. Okay, so perfect. So now when it sees iron, when we get iron, it will throw it in there automatically, which is very cool. So that leads us to our next part. Um, so we should have a couple pieces of the iron in here. Oh, wait for server. Okay, so we've got the iron essence. So what we're gonna do is hit uses. And then if you craft those around like so, um, yes, remember apply. There we go. So we have 24 iron ingots. So we'll put them in here and that's taking them out. And then we will run a cable down. Okay, I need to figure out where we're at. Okay. <laughs> okay, do we even make the importer? We didn't. <laughs> okay, so we need to make an importer. So it takes the items and puts them into our system. Um, here we go. We've got a couple of these guys. So that means we can make this. Cool. And then the importer, booyah. So there we go. Let's hit slash back. Okay. So just like this. And we are out of cable too. Great. Okay, so here we go, and shaboom. There we go, okay, so that's putting it into our system. If we look here, this is going up, cool. So now we have iron automated, That that it's as simple as that, really. Um, yes, cool, so um, let's see now, we should probably make this look good again. Perfect. Okay, so look at that. We've already got up to 74 iron here. So now we just need to kind of patch this area up a bit. Um, I've been working on this area. I don't know if I've showed you guys this area, but I've been kind of working on it. I mean, you guys have kind of seen it throughout the episode. So that's, that's that. Okay, so we got this guy all sealed up now. So it's looking good. We got the glass here. I mean, it's not perfect. We might, um, you know, kind of come back here on live stream uh, on Saturday and maybe just focus on making the base look good. Um, but yeah, so we have all of that set up. Um, this looks pretty good. There might be a way to make these look better. If you guys know a way to make the, the pipes look better up top, let me know. Uh, but yeah, these have all been automated. We have automatic iron. That was super easy. Uh, what else can we get automatic? Well, um, we could automatically kill this guy. Jeez Louise, man. Always in my business. Let's see. I did like the other method that we had. Uh, the crushing wheels, but I don't think we're going to do that today. Let me see what we're going to do for the rest of the video here. So what I want to do for the rest of the video uh, here is we're actually going to get a, uh, a jetpack going so we can fly around a little bit. Um, I feel like we have enough materials for it. Uh, so that's what we're going to try to do. Um, so let's see, what are we missing here? Just the battery. Yeah. I believe we just need a few of those. Cool. Okay, we just need two, perfect. And then we need this guy. Perfect. Oh, we made one too many. That is a big bummer. Um, and then we also need some leather, but if we remember, we can just put the leather in here. No, it wasn't like that. It was like this. Yes, we just need two of them. I'm glad how quick this is from Integrated Dynamics. And this is also such a, a handy thing. So I'm very excited about it. Perfect. Uh, that's actually all we need for the, the strap there. All right. And then with the strap, booyah, we have ourselves a wooden jetpack. Amazing. So now, uh, 250. Let's make an, a copper jetpack. I've never made a copper one before. Um, so it's going to utilize these guys. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then we're going to make two of these guys. All right. And then we make a battery. And then now we can make a copper jetpack. 
Oh yeah, 250,000. All right, uses. Okay, so iron, 800,000. Bronze, 800,000. Silver is 1.2. So we're gonna make silver. Um, okay, so these guys require those. How much gold do we have? We've got a couple. We'll start off with uh, 16 of these guys and see if that's enough to get us through the tiers. Um, we just need five, and then one, and then two. There we go. Okay, so we have a silver jetpack. Amazing. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, uses. So Electrum is 10 million, steel is 12 million. So steel is the one to make. Um, oops, not that one. Sorry, not that either. This here. So, oh, backspace. Um, okay, so this utilizes those. How many of the advanced coils do we have? We have five. So we use 16, so that means it takes 11 to make it. So we just need six more. Perfect. Okay, now how much steel do we have? We have no steel. Okay, we can definitely fix that real quick here. Uh, how's our iron supply looking? Oh, it's non-existent. Okay, we need to do a locking functional. Okay, so we can lock this. We're gonna lock this, 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 and that. Okay. So we can't take any iron out of there. Um, or we can take the iron out of there, but it's not gonna like ruin it. Like it's still there, okay. So over here, ooh, we have steel dust already. Okay. So let's do that many. We'll do that many, perfect. And then the steel dust, we can just smelt up over here. So we'll have 12. Um, so let's figure this out. So one, two. Three, four, five, six. So it's gonna be 12 per one of these. And then another six, so 18, 19, 20, 20 22. So we need 22 total. Um, so it just means we need 10 more, which after all of this is done processing, we should have enough to make the steel one. And then we're gonna make one more windmill from a uh, mechanism that will be uh, charging up a charger that we have it will probably set up a little power bank so it can continuously charge that while we're not looking you know um, but here we go so we need we'll do one two for the jetpacks uses wait why am I making silver dang it that is a bummer. All right, I hope that's enough because I I didn't do it right. I actually think that is enough. Yeah, we just need more steel. Okay, we got a couple more steel ingots here. So hopefully, okay, so we gotta make three more of these. Perfect, and then uses. Okay, so we just need two more steel. Okay, so we have enough to complete the steel jetpack, but I think that's as far as we'll, our resources today will be able to take us, uh, which is a big bummer. But let's put these here. So we got one, two, three. Um, we'll do this, uses. There we go, and so we have everything. We just need four more steel, which should be, yep, we have three here, but there's a couple more in the chest. Uh, we have two, so we just need two to smelt. Perfect. There we go, and here we are. We should have the steel jetpack. 12 million. 12 million, billion, 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 billion. Very cool. Oh, I didn't realize you could put enchants on it. Put protection on it, very cool. Um, yeah, so let's see about charging this guy. Okay, so we could make the mechanism charge pad, uh, which is a very feasible option. Um, yeah, we can make it. 
We cannot make it. We need more blackstone. Uh, whoops. Wait. Yes. Okay. We can make it. Yes, we can make it. Okay. We have the stone cutter. Um, we need it to be the polished. You gotta be careful. Okay. There we go. So we have enough for the charge pad. Um, we just need two more steel, which we can make. So we, we can actually make everything here. Very good. Very good. Very good. Wow. We have the perfect amount of steel to make this. Okay. So here we go. Charge pad. Amazing. Uh, so we would just stand on that, which is very cool. Uh, let's make another wind generator like this. We need two of these guys. We're out of gold. Hmm, we are out. Oh, no, we're not. Okay, we got a couple more pieces of gold. Not very much, but a couple. Two, and then that should be enough to make it. Perfect. All right, and then Mechanism has a couple of cells that we can put stuff in for energy. Yeah, basic energy cube. So we would need to make the third tier in order to have enough power left over. Each one of them requires a tier before. Okay, so we do need to make one of these. Uh, we need to make some of these, which is iron. Went there in there with redstone. We've got quite a bit of iron in there already. It's gonna be great, because I'll go AFK. Oh, we might need to make some redstone seeds. Um, so we'll do that. Yeah, redstone seeds would be pretty, pretty good. Okay, so I figured we could just put the the charger here on our cable so it could kind of charge us up. Um, yeah, we've already got 500,000 power in there, which is awesome. Oh, we got more of these guys. Stay away. So, so it says the jetpack is off. Uh, I need to configure it to work, right? Okay, iron jetpacks, toggle engine. Okay, so I've configured it so that the up arrow is when we can turn the engine on and then the down arrow is hover. Uh, so let's see how quick we are. Oh wow, this is cool. We use a lot of power though flying around and then hover mode. That's pretty good. Still using a lot of power, but the good thing is that uh, we'll eventually have it so that it will be charging up over time. Um, oh, we probably need to do something about that too. Fall damage. But we'll do that in a later episode. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, guys, don't forget to subscribe. But this has been Super Turtle, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.